We recently covered the astonishing precision-cut ancient ruins which can be found at Puma Punku within Bolivia. Once an enormous city complex, which still possesses some incredible features. One of the more controversial of these still surviving attractions is undoubtedly the Wall of Humanity. During the 1960s, archaeologists employed by the Bolivian government excavated a temple at Tiahuanaco. Within the walls of the courtyard, hundreds of stone heads were discovered, all with a diverse range of features masterfully built into the architecture. A once perfectly constructed wall, adorned with a variety of different faces, each now believed by a number of independent researchers to represent the different tribes and civilizations which could be found upon our planet at the time. If proven true, it is clearly a controversial reality for academia to explain. How can a wall, supposedly built by the Incas, display faces from all corners of the world, built by people who never traveled intercontinentally? Or does the wall of humanity further support the premise of a world-going advanced civilization actually having once built such sites? Furthermore, and perhaps the most intriguing detail surrounding this ancient artifact, is the addition of two heads made of a noticeably different material that, instead of displaying a possible lost tribe, appears to actually represent what many would now identify as grey aliens. The question is, if the Wall of Humanity does indeed represent the different tribes which could be found all over the world at the time of its creation, then who, or indeed what, do these two faces represent? Are the ancient alien theories true? Did an extraterrestrial race not only once visit our planet, but actually called it home? Clearly an astonishing ancient artifact which demands more alternative research.